if you've been paying attention at all over the last few months, uh, you know that we have been battling to get our house put back together. <clears throat> I have talked about it ad nauseum, I'm sure. And one of the problems that we've had is that while the, the contractor that we had would have long periods of not showing up to work, and there would be times when we would just be out and out lied to, I suppose, the quality of the work was great. He was a nice guy, a lot of fun to be around. And I just kind of got stuck. I mean, after all, I knew that I needed to fire him for a long time. I knew that probably back in October or November, but I felt like I was trapped into this thing between my contractor and my insurance company and the work. And as a result, I was frustrated a lot I was, I was dealing with a lot of crap from getting the house not done. And it was just a very frustrating experience to feel like I was stuck in a place that I could not get out of. That's a horrible feeling. And if you add to the fact that I'm generally a nice guy, <laughs> And I find it really difficult sometimes to pull the trigger and end something that I know needs to be ended. I will struggle with it and live with it and deal with it and try to fight through it and whatever else I have to do to keep from making the decision I know I have to make. Sound familiar? Now, I wish I could say that I had a grand plan. But I didn't have a plan. Um, I didn't have a backup. I didn't have anything. But all of us at times, we get stuck. We just get stuck. We get stuck in a relationship maybe that we know is not good for us or maybe we're stuck in a job that wasn't something we had planned for our lives at the beginning. Um, maybe we're just stuck in a mindset. Maybe we're stuck in this whole action of fear related around a pandemic. Um, whatever it is, all of us face it. And to you, I would say exactly what my papa said years ago, do something, even if it's wrong. The simple fact that you take a step, that you act, that you make a decision to move outside of whatever it is that you're stuck in is huge. It will, it will be scary, no doubt, but it will also free you in ways you cannot even begin to imagine. So whatever you're stuck in, do something even if it's wrong. And if you want to, share it with me later and tell me a little bit about the decision that you made. We'll see you next week.